and then a good. Oh, are we in America? Oh, I've never seen this side of America before. Oh, it's beautiful, yeah. right? So Minnesota, you have uh, Mall of America. Here you have the Mall of Somalia. The majority of the shops here already are women. They cater to women. Oh yeah. Mashallah, hijama is also available here. The best pizza in the city. In Minneapolis. Yes. Astero, Somali Mujahideen leader against the colonists. <laughs> We're not even done yet. We're just getting started. So, Suhail, this is Muhammad. Muhammad or Ahmed? Well, the best waslat in the city is his restaurant. This is it. The historic Carmel Mall. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar So, as soon as we cross... So as soon as we cross this uh, bridge area, uh -huh. we're going to see a lot of Muslims and Somalis. You're gonna, you're gonna feel like you're in a different place, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It's like a different country. Yeah. This, all these buildings that you see, mm -hmm. these especially on this side, this side, and the mall is owned by one guy. Really? One guy. Wow. Right, so he has a massive real estate. Real estate here. Oh my right? god. And even that mosque is being built even more, and the spaces have been, you know, widened, and the parking lots are built, and he's still doing the building. You know, that's where it is, the Carmel Mall. Yeah. And if you look here, yep, Muhammad, SubhanAllah. And then Al Quds. Oh, are we in America? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is beautiful to see in America. Yeah, so, it's, uh, it illustrates the community here. Yeah. And their values. So, yeah, run away. <laughs> so these are all new too within the past. Here. Oh, I've never seen this side of America before. Oh yeah. This is beautiful uh, murals. Uh, beautiful murals on the road. Right. And here we are. As you can see there, boom. Look at that. That is it? Yeah, they're still building. But that's that's also part of Carmel Mall? Yes. Wow. It's another structure. That's like the masjid over there with the... Uh -huh. When I first came here about 10 years ago, uh -huh. the third and the fourth were not there. Really? Yes, and the parking lot was open. And so I'll show you where that is. And they're even building like hundreds of shops. So let's go inside. Wow. It's, it's just been a lot of development over the years. This is it, the historic Carmel Mall. Yeah. Bismillah Rahman Rahim. You finally entered. Oh my God. Absolutely. As you can see, the shops are very, uh, they're just oh, yeah. opening up really around this time. Uh, no, I do, I do feel like, like I'm in some <laughs> Yes, yeah, it is that. This is a different place. And so, past like, past Duhut, that's where you'll see a lot of the restaurants right. opening up. Right. Um, I see a lot of women's clothing. Yes. And so, yeah. if you go through this area, the place we want to go is up for oh, yeah. There's a barber shop here. Barber shop, Somali barber shop. So let me take you down to the soup. Some coffee and smoothies. Yeah. So they have more. We can we can grab something if you want to. Yeah. yeah. Why, brother Osman? Tell me why Carmel Mall? How did what's the history? How did this oh, man. become this is Somali hub? In like the nineties or something? Way After back. the civil war? But yeah, yeah. They are businessmen <laughs> and women. Right. It's a, a Carmel so Carmel. Um, but, but this is why I want to go upstairs to get better view. These are all new shops. Look at that. Okay. Oh yeah. So that whole area is gonna get yeah. leased out. Yeah, it's gonna get leased out. Um, and this is the back of the mall. And none of these were here before. You should know. Really? Yeah. This, this is all this new as well. In the year, last year. So Man, I gotta buy something for my uh, family as well. For we'll see <laughs> it's up to you. Family, he's gonna buy you something. Yeah, this is like... So this is the bottom floor, right? Then you have your phones over here. Right. Uh, right. The loops right here. Phobes for the brothers. And then you have... You'll be surprised how much uh, kurtas and, 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 and salat we have. Oh yeah? Yeah, the day scene is... When you go to the top levels, you're going to see a lot of them. I was not expecting this, honestly. Yeah. This, this kurtas and yeah, uh, daisy so clothes. Exactly. <laughs> we, have a, we have a good relationship with... Uh, you know what's Somali. Yes. The elders, my parents and things like that. Uh -huh. You know what was a popular thing? When it was in their time, probably the 80s and the, 90, the 80s, the 70s? Right. Was 
Hollywood music. Oh, <laughs> I know. Many that. of them know the songs and they yeah. sing it, and even this is how they would, you know, interact with each other. Right? So, brother, there's a lot of. Yes, the culture know, is here. Yeah. That's, that's the culture is right here. Culture is here. <laughs> the, I see the influences. Right. And the so, let's go upstairs. Okay. I think I should use the. Ouch! Microphone. Yeah, most of them are closed right now. This is, this is the most one of the popular ones for the young guys, the youth to come to. Right. Um, Why is that? Exactly. So look here. So these are like the shawls, and then right. they have the, the Pashto shawls. So this is for um, boys and men. Yes. Mostly? There's no, there's no Boys, clothing. men, um, okay. no, I don't think for sisters. Yeah. But nonetheless, this is still the mm -hmm. popular shop for the, for the young guys. But you know why? What? Majority of the shops here already are women. They cater to women. Oh, yeah. So I there's see not, there's not a lot of uh, men clothing, right? That's right. So, Zakwakh. And then the books, too, they have Islamic law. Yes, Islamic books and the Quran. Yes. So most of the shops are not open, as you can see. This after after the hook, they're all open. This is the the hub shield. Uh, do, do they have that? We, we passed a lot of them. We were downstairs. I wish. That's I the wish money transfer, right? Yeah. 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 And that's also very famous. And there's different types too. There's ones with our different names, but they all do the same function. This is floor this three. Is three. Yes. This is floor three. This is three. So I'm like. So they have football pizza. This is the. This is the Afghan place. The famous football pizza. Yes. So people come here let's, specifically. Let's see, the brother. Yes. Please come here. This is for the football. Assalamualaikum. How are you doing, brother? Alhamdulillah. Mashallah. This is our our brother, Sunez. And so he's 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 from. Uh, Denver. So football pizza here, like I mentioned, the best pizza in the city. In Minneapolis? Yes. There's a $5 oh. pizza, but this one here is the best and is more famous. Thank you. Appreciate right? it. Right? This is good. The Afghan, the way they do it, the style is yeah. really nice. The mosque we just came from, Masjid Dawah, we order for them from for big events. Mashallah. We go to the central one though, but we order from them. A lot of boxes. People love it. That's amazing. And they have like a nice green sauce. I don't know. Is it like chutney? A chutney. chutney. chutney yeah. yes. Right. And so, the, um, how long have you guys been here? Well, we opened four months ago. Okay. Um, oh, I mean, in, since, in Minnesota. Since January. In Minnesota. Oh, Minnesota. How? My, our first location was opened uh, more than 22 years ago in, in Central. Mashallah. That's our main location in uh, Northeast Minneapolis. Yeah. Soon, about a couple of weeks, we're going to open the Egan location. No way. It's almost done. Oh, yes, by the outlet mall. <laughs> Yeah, like it. it's very pro pro potential place, yeah. very potential place, and Masha. inshallah we'll do very good over there. Yes. Too. yes, if they want halal pizza, they should come to you. As you know that there is no halal pizza in the city, and our our pizza is not only halal; it's very tasty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. So everybody likes it, even non-Muslims. They love our pizza. So how long have you guys been here in uh, Carmel Mall? Uh, we opened it since January, so okay, it's been so like four, four, almost five, four months. How is it going? How is it's, it's going good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I was I was downstairs and I saw a sister with a, a football pizza. I'm like, Wait, but they're in Central. Where did you get this? Oh, from? Yeah. wow! Okay, that's right. And now I know. So yeah. now I know where to go. <laughs> you know where to go. Exactly. Well, Thank you, brother. Uh, uh, well, thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Brother, sorry, just one question. Yes. Well, why did you name it Football Pizza? He's asking about why it's called Football Pizza. My brother came up with it. Uh, he, okay. That was his dream to make Football Pizza and because yeah. it's shaped Football Pizza too. It looks he like walked, a football. He, walked, he came up with <laughs> Afghani Brothers like well, football shape. So he yeah. thought about making Football Pizza. That's and great. People love it. You should open one in Denver, Inshallah. Inshallah. I'm from Colorado. You should oh, open yeah. Inshallah over there. Inshallah. We need halal. Good halal food. Yeah, inshallah. <laughs> okay, inshallah. Come up there too. Inshallah, brother. Okay, Thank take you. care. Assalamu Great nice guy. Brother. Yeah, yeah, very nice brother. So currently we're entering the masjid yep. of Carmel so Mall. So you say, for example, it says here, Fatman, Kabaha, Lagali, al so they're saying don't go past this point without with your shoes on. Right. So move your right. shoes. Away. No shoes allowed beyond this point. Yeah. MashaAllah, hijama is also available here. Yes. 
there's uh, there's a couple of different hijama centers you can go to. One in uh, northeast. This one is here located, and then you have even socket over there. Mashallah, what a beautiful masjid. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Mashallah, what an absolutely beautiful masjid here in Carmel Mall. I'm talking slowly because a lot of brothers are reading the Quran. Mashallah, it's massive, brother. Big. It's really big. The top is the sister's section. This area is a little, a little hidden, but uh, it's perfect for Jummah. Oh, yeah. When the, once the lights come on, you can see it. So, Minnesota, you have uh, Mall of America, and here you have the Mall of Somalia yeah, <laughs> and Carmel Islam. Uh, Carmel Mosque. The mosque is named uh, Masjid Carmel. So Masjid, Masjid Carmel. Carmel. So it's also named after the mall. For being a mall masjid, mm -hmm. I didn't have a lot of expectations, but uh, honestly, this is one of the most beautiful, you know, <laughs> welcoming. Look at the top. Yeah, I, the I did. I did. You can tell the, the brothers they put a lot of effort, a lot of effort, a lot of art into this yep. space and seeing the brothers uh, reading the Quran mashallah usually mosques are closed yeah, at this time, time right yeah. Yeah. yeah now we're going to go to the fourth floor which is the last floor right. this floor is the restaurants so let's go check it out you're fourth enjoy. floor you're going to enjoy it up the stairs once again yeah if you're not a fit person uh, yeah you definitely will be after this so everything that's going down this angle is all restaurants. So most of the restaurants here open After around lunchtime. Yes, it around breakfast. around Dohur. They're going to open up. They're starting to open up right now. Not a lot of options for breakfast, but at oh, lunchtime. No, breakfast there is. Yeah. Immediately after Fajr, you have some restaurants open. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> the camera is towards me. Oh my God, brother. Look at this. It's beautiful, right? This is probably the hallmark of the culture. And uh, this here is historically like the uh, uh, Somali uh, uh, Mujahideen leader against the colonists, right? What's so, his name? Um, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I forgot. You get his idea. Yes, yeah, so I, I went through it once, one time, but just, you know. Yeah. So, Look, the culture is all here. Salam alaikum. Alhamdulillah, what's going on? So, Suhail? This is Muhammad. Muhammad Muhammad Both. My friend, he immigrated to Seattle. He's from uh, Galkayo. Oh, okay. So, I know a few cities, but I... You know, I'm a uh, first generation myself, so I keep forgetting that, mashallah, there's second, third generation. No, your first generation of the Desi community is different from ours. You've been here, your community has been here longer than us, in America, I mean. And then we came here probably in the 90s, after the Civil War. We came here to you already here. Yeah. The contribution of the Desi community is the concept and innovation of halal meat. Right? Halal right. meat really was put on the scene by the JC community when they first came here. They said, well, we need halal meat. Right? Yeah. And from there, it inspired all the other communities. They're strong on halal meat. Mashallah. But there will be a couple that, you know, they're, yeah. they're hanging out. How long you've been here? Here since December 2022. Um, so that's about six months now. Here at this mall. My other restaurant uh, is family owned. And we've been operating since July 2020. Uh, so like if anybody, anybody like a non-Somalian like me comes, what would you suggest to, to eat for lunch? For lunch, you never go wrong with uh, baris and basla. It's a large piece of meat, it's usually eaten uh, as a group of people, two or more. The best waslat in the city is his restaurant. Ask really? Dan or that. Yes. <laughs> Damn. Mashallah. What is this Midwest, cater <laughs> Midwest catering? It's really nice. It his family has another one in Abu Bakr Mosque, it's the same restaurant. And right. so they have the also the same type of meat. SubhanAllah. If you're hungry, yeah. Oh wait. Come here. <laughs> yeah, Midwest. come here. But I, was, I meant for you. Thank right? you so much, brother. Thank you. Salaam alaikum. Salaam alaikum. 
Yeah, a lot of a lot of clothing stores so, up here yep. too. Like I told you, most of them are women. They're women clothing. They cater yeah. to women. So yeah. there's not really a lot of you know. Yeah, places uh, for men. Yes, and that's okay because we don't need too many. <laughs> yeah, we just need a few. <laughs> Good shop yes, here. Gold shop. Gold right shop right here on the food court behind us. So it really is like. Uh, this is a souvenir. To another country. Yeah. 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 Sure. So there is an elevator too. I would say that usually the elevators, the women, the women go on it. Okay. So it's yeah. good to go on the stairs. Yeah, so Alhamdulillah in Minnesota, there's a lot of pockets where you can go to of the Muslim community and you can feel the presence there and see the progress that they've made. If you go to Central, for example, Central Avenue, mm -hmm. um, starting all the way from where you go past Broadway Ave, immediately you start hitting uh, halal meat shops, right? Right. So there's the, I think it's called like Little India World, and that's like a, a desi halal shop. They have halal meat. Yeah. Um, that you can buy. They, saw, they also have a lot of other products as well that are the Muslim uh, communities and, and cultures they're, they're used to, like uh, parate, jalati, all these things, oh. right? And then the, you have your chutney, anything you want there that you have. Then you go a little bit further down the block, you have uh, football pizza, and that's an Afghani pizza place, right? And then they also have uh, Afghani food, cultural food that they sell. Right, and it's very popular, even with the non-Muslims, they love the football pizza. Then you right. go a little bit further down, it's not the biggest restaurant, most famous and popular, which is Holy Land. And many people come out to it, and it's like a, a Palestinian, a yes, wow. Palestinian. It was even on the one of the food channels. They're also very successful as well, Mashallah. because they have, um, you know, Mediterranean food that they sell, but they also have a very successful uh, uh, market where you can go shop for things, uh, halal, uh, marshmallows, those sort of things, but also- Halal marshmallows. Yes, nice. couscous and things that yes. um, our communities have Somali products, Desi products, Arab products, you know, a food wow. and things like that you can buy. And so it's, that's, then you go a little Seven. bit further down. We're not even done yet. We're just getting started. <laughs> you go further up central, then you get to uh, New York Gyro, and it's a Desi spot where they have, you know, they, they, they specialize in Desi, Pakistani food mainly, and Indian food. Mm -hmm. And then they also have street food as well that they kind wow. of made up and they're very creative with it. And a lot of the youth like to go there as well. Right next door is $5 Pizza which is uh, owned by, um, I think he's either Afghani or Iranian man, Ali, good guy. And then he has halal pizza. So halal meats and all things. You oh can get. Central yeah. Avenue is the place to be. Central there. Avenue is the place. And then you go around that area too. I missed out two restaurants, which were also Mediterranean, which are Filfila. And then you have a buffet restaurant, which is Mediterranean and more, uh, which is called um, Marina's. So that's just on Central. Right. Within the area, you have uh, three three to four masajid just in the area, that street. That okay. encompasses uh, um, a span of five miles. Right. Within five miles, you have access to four different masajid. I see why it's hard to leave. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. And so there's a lot that's happening, but then also there's challenges as well, right? Yeah. And this is kind of... Um, uh, you, it, it comes with progress. You'll have challenge. Yeah. In any part of life. Obstacles. Every, exactly. <laughs> What are we looking at here? We're looking at a lot of things. This is this is Kenyan. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Wa alaikum salam. How are you? I'm doing well. This is Kenyan. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Over. Good, yes. brother. How are you? Alhamdulillah. What job do you do? <laughs> this is brother uh, Uthman's shopping shop. <laughs> Mashallah, you, you look ready. <laughs> yeah, it's a little you bit. Ready for business. But, uh, Mashallah, so brother. Have to be situated in the situation. Right? Yeah. <laughs> what is this? This is a kufi. So this is uh, your traditional Somali kufi. 
yeah. box kufi. You know, when you saw the old men yes. who were kicking us out almost. <laughs> this is what they look like. Yes, They're absolutely. <laughs> so, this year, traditional oh, box kufi. Um, but, nice. the, but the way the young guys do it is they, they shorten it like this. All right. And they put it on. Very nice. It's, it's, um, it's, a, it's a hack. How much is it, brother? This here? Yeah. These are 20. Wow. Yeah. So it depends Beautiful. what kind of. Yeah. Uh, you look like you're from Amman. You really? know what that is? Yes. Uh, yes, uh, Amman. They wear this year, exact man. hat. So they share this hat with us. Oh, so, right. yeah. So East Africa and Oman, we have the same style of, of headgear. Nice. And so if you had like a Omani thobe on, you would yeah. you would pass. <laughs> You'd pass. <for> it. <laughs> That's and great, so, brother. Yeah. I'll I'll take so, it, brother. I'll you want to take this one, or inshallah. do you want a different color? You want this? You like this color? I like this. Color. Okay, Masha. Okay. It's uh, inshallah. It's different. Zakhlaal <laughs> khair. Thank you, brother. So, this man has beautiful. Yeah. I was going to have a more beautiful, so forgive the... <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Inshallah. Any last message for the viewers? I would say Min Minnesota is a place of many flavors. Mm -hmm. And we invite everyone to come here, alhamdulillah. Um, inshallah, you know, this is Mudkas of Da'wa, the 605 Fairview Avenue. Um, we are still also doing a fundraising as well. So anyone that would want to help with that, inshallah, we put the link around somewhere. And yeah, you know, you're always welcome here. I'm Brother Uthman. And if you come here, message me, find me somewhere. Truly your brother on the Instagram, inshallah. And, you know, we're, we're happy love. to do this with you. Dean Love as well. The only Dawah podcast in Minnesota. Hit us up, check us out, and you know, Jazakum Al Khairan. And we're happy to have been with you on this journey. And we ask Allah to uh, bless Absolutely. your efforts. Thank you so much, Shahid Osman. It's been an absolute pleasure.